understand? My Don't do anything. Just stay here. My brother, yeah, yeah. Man, real wild, yeah. boy, you heard? Yeah. Right now, we the biggest movie. Yeah. Identity family will back again on the Africa Identity platform. My name is King Ages and I'm here to give you guys a new insight on what's going on the on ground in Africa and international community. My people, I'm here to give you guys the insight of how God and love bring a lot of African children back to Africa in 2023. My people, the year was a beautiful year around Africa. 2023 was a beautiful year around Africa. We see the Ghana love that started from the year of return when Ghana started the year of return initiative where we see a lot of African children around the world moving straight down to Ghana to see the beautiful motherland, to see the beautiful heritage of people coming from West Africa, the beautiful people of Ghana, the love they show around the world have really transformed Iran the world to Nigeria to Kenya to Uganda to Zambia to Malawi all around Africa most of the African leaders now are looking for other initiatives to bring a lot of people down to their country for a better understanding of their culture and their heritage around Africa so this is a good look so I'll be showing you a lot of people that come through to Africa to celebrate to help and to assist the people on the own ground in Africa. I want to see more people in South Africa have ownership, have more ownership. We in Johannesburg, you know, it's all about, like myself, um, I own my career, I own myself, I became my own boss, and even in America, it's about real estate. So I want, the, the, you know, the people in Africa, you guys you have all the resources, you, got, you guys have all the land, but we need to get a lot of that land back to the Africans and you guys need to own yourself. I always want to inspire my people and push my people, let them know they can be great like myself. Uh, I didn't do it by myself, you know. I did it with the push from the fans all around the world and especially the fans from Africa. And my, my people from Africa, they pushed me first and, and I love them first. a lot of people coming to South Africa, coming to Ghana, coming to Nigeria, coming to Guinea-Bissau, Guinea-Conakry, Angola, and we have multiple people like Floyd Mayweather, we have uh, Idris Alba, we have Mick Mill, we have a lot of multiple people. So the reason why I come out to speak about this is because if we keep helping ourselves and if a lot of people keep coming to Africa, is a lot of good look. We see what our brother Mr. Easy do in Rwanda. I started a company and he started a little business in Rwanda just to build his own estate in Rwanda. This is a beautiful look. It doesn't mean you're in Nigeria, you have to own your business to Nigeria alone. You can do your business in Ghana. You can see Mr. Easy, how he moves around, juggles around Ghana, Kenya. He goes everywhere in Africa for business purposes. He's a businessman to the core. I mean, if he have already shared a lot of his initiative, a lot of his idea on the music industry in Africa. So Mr. Easy is somebody a lot of people should go into and they should learn a lot from. So we seen I had good understanding and he had good relationship with the people of Rwanda. He's a Nigerian. 
is a Nigerian and is having a good business with the people of Rwanda. Every day, yeah, ADHI. ADHI, yeah. 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 So this is a good look coming from Mr. Easy. There is a lot of other people around Africa. We see the video. We see the video himself, the big man in the Afrobeat music scene. How he bring, how he put down a lot of American artists to Nigeria, and how they work together hand in hand in showing them the beauty of Nigeria, the culture of Nigeria, the culture of Africa and a lot of the people that I brought around like Fresh Montana, Sweet Lee. We got it on until the sun one. come up. <laughs> we got it on until the sun came up, Nigeria. You know, yeah, David O. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, man, shout out to my brother David O. Vito. Send it out. My guys, you know what I'm saying? Nigeria, mashallah. I wish you well. I wish you well. I love you too, bro. Hey. Whoever this here is balling right here. The only ones that got the bridge up there. They got the George Washington bridge up there. Connecting. Crazy. One of the illest spots, right? Yeah. In the world. A lot of people that they brought around, they really appreciate the culture of the homeland in Africa. This is a good look because we see a lot of these brothers coming back home to help, to start a business, you know, to add to the economy of Africa. We see Floyd Mayweather said he wanted to, he want to help the people of Nigeria. He want to start his own business there. That he see a lot of people trying to look for their heritage, to find it straight back to Africa. This is a beautiful look for this brother. So my people, I just came out to give you guys the new insight because on my platform is all about unity. So my people, I really appreciate everybody that will be working with me throughout 2023. 2024 will be a beautiful year. I will come with a lot of good insight for you to show you guys a lot of cultural heritage from Africa and talks about politics, everything on the on ground in Africa, sport, entertainment, just name it. Once it's coming from Africa and around the world, I'm gonna speak about it. Thanks and I really appreciate everybody that will be following me on the platform. It's one love, it's one Africa, it's one unity, unity over division, my people, one love.